an easy and effective way to troubleshoot network issues reported by What's Up Gold is to analyze the network traffic data reported by Flowmon. Under Analyze, you will find a new dashboard called Flowmon, and it will show you the Flowmon dashboard as well as the Flowmon events uh, report. The Flowmon dashboard is pulling data directly, or it's presenting data that's pulled directly from Progress Flowmon. So instead of having to juggle between two interfaces, you can see data from both the network monitoring side as well as the packet analysis, the network traffic analysis side into one interface. And so this dashboard is presenting that data from Flowmon directly. And so here under the network operations tab, you will see network specific patterns like traffic, response times, um, retransmission rates, and so on. It will show you this type of data in this particular view. Under the security operations uh, section, it will show you events by methods or events by severity. Uh, you will see different method types like DIFCOM, scans, and so on. So these are basically different types of behavior patterns that the traffic analysis tool is picking up, like diverse communications with multiple IP addresses, maybe communications with uh, specific types of countries. And you will notice also that they are these events are assigned severity levels, like critical, high, medium, and low. And so this particular report will track these events and severity by their numbers and graph this for you. Again, this is data that is being pulled directly from Flowmon. To take a look at the actual events, you will go to the Flowmon events report, select the Flowmon source, and uh, for whatever time, date range you select, it will show you all of the events that have been recorded uh, for that period. And so you will see them by severity and then you will see them by methods. At the top, you will see a nice uh, pie chart that makes it very convenient to, for example, filter all of the critical events. And here I can see all of the critical events that have been recorded. I can turn it off by turn that off by clicking critical and then jump over to the events by method uh, pie chart where I can um, filter by any specific uh, method that I want. Uh, I, can, I can look at country, I can look at uh, high transmissions, I can look at DIVCOM, multiple IP addresses, so on. So it's that easy to see this data um, uh, from within the WhatsApp Go web interface that's being pulled directly from our Flowmon software.